Hey guys, I'm Fontana and welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a minute. I mean, it's been a while since my last video in English. I really apologize. I have been more active. I have been more active actually on Instagram. So make sure to follow me there as well. There I'm at Fontana. I got this box from Urban Decay Cosmetics all the way from California to the freezing cold Sweden. And honestly, I am beyond excited to try these products today because I love Urban Decay. First, because they have amazing vegan products. They are also very inclusive. And I consider Urban Decay to be a very no gender kind of makeup brand, if you know what I mean. They always have boys, girls, and non-binary people on their campaigns, on their social media, and I really appreciate that. Plus, I think at Stay Naked Foundation, they came out with 50 shades, which is incredible. We know how important it is and they are doing a great work when it comes to that. Today I'll be doing my full face wearing Urban Decay products. If you want to see the full Fontana Glam, make sure to go to my Instagram. I made a full face video wearing only Urban Decay products and I mean the results came out so amazing. Please make sure to go there right now and check it out. Oh my gosh, I am so excited because honestly, I don't think I have seen any negative reveal about this new foundation they came out with. It's actually pretty hyped here on YouTube, on Instagram. Everyone is loving it and myself, I think I'm gonna love it too. It's called Stay Naked Hydro Maniac Tinted Glow Hydrator. Up to 24 hour hydration, yas. Lasting all day moisture. Skin is significantly, skin is significantly old. Of course, I don't know how to pronounce this word. If you guys don't know, I am Brazilian, but I live in Sweden, so my head is really messy with all the languages I speak. Significantly. Okay, your skin is really hydrated after 24 hours. It says up to 24 hour glow, dewy, juicy finish, yas. It has kombucha filtrate and marula oil, and it's vegan. We love this. I really need some glow and hydration in my life because I live in Stockholm, Sweden, and it's winter here, so it's actually really dry out there. They sent me two shades, 41 light medium and 50 medium. I'll show you guys. I mean, this is the packaging. This one is the 41 and this one is the 50. I am going for the 50 at this moment. This one in the summer will look flawless. And by swatching it, I can feel that it's actually very hydrating. I have a feeling I am going to love it. It's really creamy and once you work with it, it kind of melts into your skin. Oh my gosh, the glow already. Ooh, girl. It doesn't really smell like anything. But we're actually going to start with the All Nighter Ultra Glow Face Primer. I'm giving you the full glow Urban Decay experience. I'll be using the primer only on my left side. It's completely transparent. Let's do this. It doesn't really smell like anything. Oh my gosh, it's actually very, very, very smooth. It feels really nice on the skin. We have the primer on this side and not on this one. Super fresh and glowy. And about my pores and fine lines, they look good. They look moisture. And now let's try the superstar of this video that it's the Hydro Maniac. I am so excited. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are we ready for this? Since it's a medium coverage, let's see how it performs on my face. This is so beautiful. Oh, oh my gosh. Do you see this? This is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. It, it has much more coverage than I thought it would have and I love it. Beautiful glowy finish. I mean, wow. Wow, 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 I love this. It's beautiful. It is the fresh, healthy glow I love. We are going to build a little bit more on top of this layer because there are some areas here I want to cover a little bit more, but I could definitely go out with only this layer. Next layer, let's apply a little bit more here. Not too much. Wow, 
Wow, wow, wow. I love this. So pretty, so beautiful. Let me get a little closer to you. So far, so good. Everything creases on my face. I really have a hard time with foundations when it comes to the area around my mouth. So we shall see how it will perform. Cheers. I'm using one of my favorite concealers ever, and that is the Stay Naked Concealer. It's a full coverage matte concealer. They actually recommended to wear this with the foundation. So let's see how it goes. I have just realized I don't have any baking powder from Urban Decay, so I'll be using Huda Beauty's Banana Bread Baking Powder. I'll be right back. Bam! And now it's time for eyebrows. I'll be using Urban Decay Brow Blade Shade Dark Drapes. I'll be doing this off camera because it takes me forever, so I'll be right back. <laughs> eyebrows done. I powder my face as well because I'll be gone for the whole day. And right now, we are going to try it, the Urban Decay Face and Lip Tint. They sent me other colors. Thank you so much. I actually think maybe the one in the middle. They are really cute and really moisture as well. Which one should I go for? Oh my gosh. I want to have them all. I will start with a straight. If it's still light, I can just apply a little bit of quiver. Oh my gosh. Let's do this. I'm a bit afraid. We start slow then. You know what? This is actually very cute. But I want more. Give me, give me more, give me more. Should I go for this orange one? I just, okay. Yes. Bam. So cute. This was a bang. Okay, and the last one. I have to use them all. <laughs> Quiver. Okay, this is intense. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Oh my gosh. What have I done? Why use one shade of blush when I can have three on top of each other? You know what? I love this. I'm so shy all the time. Oh my gosh. I'll be using the Stay Naked 3 Sound. This one I didn't get on this PR pack. I do own it myself. We'll skip the blush for this time because I already got some of it going on on my face already. This one is Stay Naked The Fix, shade 50 Warm Yellow. So I'm just gonna use it around my nose to snatch it out. Hashtag snatched. You guys know I am obsessed about highlighters. This one is Urban Decay Stone Vibes. I got this one on my PR pack as well. I mean, look at this, how pretty. Oh my gosh. She's shining. Oh my Lady Gaga, oh my Britney. Look at me now. Honestly, I'm internally screaming at this moment. I just can't stop applying it. It's so pretty. I mean, it's a nice mix of a rosy gold. I love this. Love, love, love this. Good job, Ermine K. For my eye look, I'll be using eyeshadow primer potion. And for eyeshadow, we're of course using a Naked Honey. I genuinely think that everyone has its own Naked. My Naked is actually Naked Honey. I love this. I'm obsessed. Another reason why we love Urban Decay is because they have amazing ambassadors. Excuse me, they have Ezra Miller, Normani, Elizo. Have you guys seen Elizo wearing this palette? It's just bomb. It's just fucking bomb. It's amazing. We start with the eyeshadow Hive. Now I'm using Sting. I want to light up a little bit, so I'm gonna use Amber with my finger. Yes! Honestly, so pretty! Now it's setting spray time. This is actually my favorite setting spray ever. It's All Nighter Ultra Glow. Oh my gosh, so pretty. For mascara, I'm using a Lash Break. 
And here's the final look using only products by Urban Decay, except my baking powder, but everything else was Urban Decay. My honest reveal is I love everything about it. Let's start with the primer. I don't see any difference so far from the side that I had the primer and from the side that I didn't have the primer. I cannot say that I have more glow on this side, honestly. Um, so we shall see during the day how it's going to perform. But when I applied it, it was beautiful. It was very soft, very smooth. It gave me definitely more hydration. So I just think that I'm going to see a difference at the end of the day. The foundation, I love it. At this moment, it is a little matte on my T-zone and under my eyes because I had to powder and bake uh, on these areas because I will be out for the whole day. But can we take a moment to appreciate this? So pretty. Wow. I'm just praying it's going to be good all day long. I'm just really, really hoping. Please, I'm rooting for you. <laughs> I love this face and lip tint. I think I'll love them even more without any makeup on at all. I think they're just going to be so pretty. Just to, mwah. the highlighter, I have no words. I am so obsessed. So pretty. Everything else I have already tried before and I was already a big fan. This setting spray. It doesn't give you the most glow, but it definitely gives you hydration. And during the day, you get the nice fresh glow and your makeup stays on place for the entire day. All the products I use are mentioned down below in the description of this video. And I'll keep you guys updated about this foundation. And we are back. It's been almost 10 hours since I have applied this makeup this morning. I am rooting so much for this foundation because the finish was just Flawless and so beautiful. I am so impressed, honestly. It hasn't moved anywhere. Everything is in place. My blush, my highlighter, do you see this? My contour, my bronzer, my brows. And I must say that I have been outside. It's minus 15 here in Sweden. It's really, really cold. It was actually really cool to see how it would perform from being inside where it's warm and being outside in the cold for a while. Everything is on place. There's nothing that has moved around at all. Honestly, it looks flawless. As I told you before, everything crazy is on my face. My forehead looks perfect around the eyes. It looks amazing. The only thing I need to flag is the lines in my mouth. And now we're gonna see the difference between the primer because on this side where I actually had the primer, the line is much, much more soft than in the side that I didn't have the primer. But honestly, from a distance, I don't see it at all because I have eaten, I have talked all day long. I mean, this part is moving all the time. So that's why, of course, we get the little tiny marks here. By the way, I didn't powder my face. I didn't do anything with my face all day long. I just let it be the way it is. I am so happy. I am so excited. Hydromaniac foundation passed the test. I was running so much. This glow is everything. I have no, I have no words. I am so happy. Thank you so much, Urban Decay. You killed it. You nailed this foundation. Wow. The only thing I need to show you guys, it's just really around my mouth, but every foundation does this. This is actually really, really soft. It's like nothing compared to the other foundations I use on my daily basis. I don't know what to say. I think this is my new favorite foundation. Today, so far, Hydromaniac Foundation by Urban Decay. It's my absolute new favorite foundation. Most of the long wear foundations that I wear, they are always matte. I haven't seen any foundation with a glow hydration finish at all to be this long wear, you know what I mean? And the glow I have now, I don't consider this to be like the crazy glow. I honestly think this is the healthy, beautiful, fresh glow that I love. If there was no COVID, I could just Put on some lipstick and go out right now and my makeup looks flawless. I am so happy. I am so happy. Thank you so much, Urban Decay, that sent these products to me. I am so happy. Bam, you guys. I am so happy. Amazing freaking work, you guys. My pores are not even showing at this point. This foundation is actually vegan for some people that insist in saying that you can't reach some specific finish or a specific high quality with products that are vegan, you are lying. I don't want to take my makeup off at all. <laughs>
I just want to stay flawless forever. Cheers for that. Well, well, this was a happy day, guys. Thanks for watching my video. Please make sure to subscribe to this channel. Leave it a like. Drop a comment down here. Let me know what you think about this makeup, about this foundation. Make sure to follow me as well on Instagram. There, I'm at Fontana. And on Twitter, I'm It's Fontana. Hope you like this video. Please let me know if you want more videos like this. I had so much fun because this makeup is just fantastic. Hope you're doing great. Stay fabulous and see you very, very soon. Bye!